Hi guys, welcome back to Jundis React. For this video reaction, guys, let's go to Pajan P once again because it's close to Miss Universe, the 69th Miss Universe. You're so excited to know uh, the top 21 because there is a new set of rules or new format for this year's Miss Universe. And let's get to know in this video that we need to do some reaction for today. And the title of this video: uh, Miss Universe 2020 Top 21 Letterboard in a new format. So we will. During in this uh, video, guys, we will know the format. So every year, guys, we will be changing the format. Sometimes we will give like a 16, a top 16 only, and then top 15 for the semi-final list. And a uh, credit to the owner also with the video, our favorite content creator, Crown Sisters. I'll put in the description box below so that you can connect also with Crown Sister because she is so wonderful in making like a like a video, guys, a video compilation. That's why I really love to do on her channel to do some reaction because she's so amazing also allow me to read some information in her description guys this year the miss universe 2020 will have a top 21 semi-finalists miss universe 2020 finalists next month will choose a top 21 semi-finalist to go forward this first year the, the miss universe has selected a top 21 semi-finalist round this is our miss universe top 21 semi-finalist production we would be interested to know your favorite top 21 yes guys because i have i have on my mind also but i have my top 10 already uh based also with crown sister c chooses also the best like top 20 or top 21 guys my previous video reaction like the best walk and the best national costume c chooses like most of them are my top also my favorite so I hope guys will be having fun and enjoy watching with this uh, Miss Universe Top 21 and new format also. And if you're new to my channel, just click on the subscribe button, click on the notification bell so that you'll be updated on our future uploads. And if you have some comments, suggestion related to pageant, you guys drop it on our comment section. I'd love to read and respond to you all and make your video requests. Enjoy guys! <laughs> Throughout the history of the Miss Universe pageant, the finale format of the competition has seen many changes. The number right. of semi-finalists can get very confusing. <laughs> Starting in 2018, 20 semi-finalists were selected from four different groups, oh. each hailing from a different region in the world. African, Asia Pacific, pa Europe, the Americas, and a wild card group. Oh, okay. This year, the Miss Universe organization has revealed the finale format of the 69th edition of the competition. I think it started with uh, Trump era. On this occasion, the highest number of contestants true to the semi-finals. Yes, it's the first time. Hello everyone, and welcome to Crown Sisters. In today's episode, I give you our Miss Universe 2020 Top 21 Pre-Arrival Leaderboard. I love her but voice. But before we begin, please make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't done it yet. Go on, I know <laughs> no, you want you to. <laughs> Since there are less contestants competing this year, you would think that it would be less competitive. But you could never be so wrong. There are over 30 girls that deserve to be in my top 21. Wow. Check those out by the end of the video. Here's our top 21 leaderboard. Up first, at number 21, Brazil, mm -hmm. Julia Gama. Despite a slow start, her latest styling is presenting a more exciting and youthful vibe. Wow. She clearly up her game to let everyone know that the unstoppable force is back <laughs> and she is here to slay. Right. Good. At number 20, Mexico. Uh, Andrea La she's Maxima been on the top. Mesa. She may be a pageant patty to some, but for me she's stunning. Really? Graceful, intelligent, determined and incredibly brave for competing in another pageant and that's what excites me the most about her. Should Andrea win, she'll be the first woman in history to place first runners-up in Miss World and then cross over to win Miss Universe. Universe. Wow! That's amazing! This is amazing! 
first time on our little boat at number 19, Venezuela. Mariangel Villas Mill. I couldn't ignore Venezuela anymore. Her beauty may look ordinary, but the royalty of the Miss Universe pageant has always come prepared. Their preparations are always intentional, on point, and meaningful. Venezuela has agree. to be here. Very agree. She's wow, glamorous. At number 18, India. Atlene Castellino. Atlene is one of the most beautiful contestants to come out of India for a long time. Right. Her global appeal is going to be one of her strengths together with her passion for her advocacies that are truly close to her heart. This could be the year that their 20-year drought ends. <laughs> 20 years. At number 17, Canada. Canada. Mm. One Nova the Stevens. This six foot supermodel is the aliquot Miss Universe. She has strong platform, yeah. she's beautiful inside and out, and will so surely well. dazzle the judges with her microphone skills. Yeah. I think she's the an ability activist. to deliver a speech is utterly important in this competition. Right. In fact, interviews contribute to 60% of the preliminary scores, and Nova Stevens is a confident and powerful speaker. At number 16, Australia, Maria Tatil. The best things come in small packages. Maria <laughs> yeah, is probably like one of the most glamorous uh, candidates short. Miss yeah. Universe Australia has sent in years. She doesn't fit the tall, blonde, beach babe Aussie stereotype. But if I may say this, but what she lacks she in height, so she makes up with beauty and yeah, brains. That's good. I love her eyes. At number 15, Vietnam, mm. Nguyen Tran Can Van. Model. This supermodel is yeah. one of the hot favorites from the Asia and the Pacific region. The 27-year-old is the epitome of grace and sincerity. And she has a wow. fantastic warm smile, so much personality, and walks with sublime elegance and confidence. Sublime I feel that elegance. she's a real contender for the crown. As long as they get her a better interpreter this time, she will deliver. Wow. Vietnam knows so what she stands Asian. for, but by not being overly aggressive. Bravo. At number 14, Nepal, Anshika Sharma. Nepal's success in her national pageant wasn't a surprise at all to me. She's stunningly beautiful, switch on, statuesque, extremely commercial, and her walk, I feel like her walk needs its own name. Being yeah. trained by Jonas Gafford, ah. we could be in for a big surprise. Oh. No, at I number don't. 13, How Chile, Daniela Nicolás. One of the at strongest. 28, Chile is one of the oldest contestants in the competition. She 20. caught my eye during her national finals. She doesn't smile a lot, but every move she does is well thought out and very well executed. Wow. This girl is in Maybe it to win it. Maybe she will and if she a wins surprise. Miss Universe, she will be Chile's second title holder. Nice eyes, nice lips. Wow. Maybe she will At be a number surprise. 12, Malaysia, Francisca James. James. This indigenous girl is the queen of minorities and the most exciting delegate Malaysia Correct. has ever sent. Long legged. When she walks, her hips tell a story. She has come out of the shadows and her performance is getting stronger and stronger each day. She surprised me and I'm sure she was many over the coming weeks. This could be the year for Malaysia. Right, my be. She is so dangerous also. Wow. At number 11, Thailand, Amanda Obdam. The Thai Canadian beauty is recently generating lots of pre-pageant bass. Amanda is the face of Asia and the one to beat. However, her potential Achilles heel is a Q&A. 
because Miss she's a strong Universe woman. Miss Universe is a marathon and not a sprint. And Thailand has a habit of not finishing strong. If Thailand could piece it all together and stay strong to the end, this could be their year. Year, yeah. She's incredibly amazing. At number 10, Indonesia, so Roro cute. Ayu Maulida. Wow. This law Another student is a fierce fashion contender. model. Indonesia has an extremely majestic walk and strong stage presence. Indonesia is a walking One expert, of my top ten. and I can't wait to see her slay the Miss Universe stage. Love that. At number nine, Puerto Rico, Estefania Soto. Puerto Rico has the ability to evoke sophistication and elegance on stage. Despite her exceptional achievements, Puerto Rico remains humble. I've also noticed how wow. incredibly generous she is with her time, even towards small-time pageant analysts, which has won her many fans, wow. me included. I'm following Puerto Rico very closely, yeah. and I really hope this is her year. Wow. At number 8, Jamaica, Michael Simone Williams. The black Barbie with a very unique name, Jamaica is confident in her own skin and doesn't need to hide behind makeup. I love the color of her skin, a perfect model to end the world's obsession with lighter skin. I watched her many interviews and I was besotted by her wit and genuine warm personality. Right. She also struck me as someone who's funny and articulate. She always speaks from the heart. Another if Jamaica surprise. wins Miss Universe, she will be the pageant's first ever title holder from her country. I love the color of the skin. God, At number beauty. 7, Nicaragua, Ana Marcelo. Ana Marcelo is one of my personal favorites from the Americas to win the crown this year. Nicaragua is driven, focused, nice. and is outspoken with her ideas. When she speaks, she speaks from the heart, nice. making her one of the most passionate candidates from the Latin region. Bra no Nicaragua is wow. ready. Other girls would underestimate her at their peril. Oh my God. We should watch her. Nicaragua. At number six, Curacao, Chantal Yus. She landed late in our leaderboard, but she showed up the earliest in the Miss Universe nest. The most improved candidate from the Americas is also one of the most sincere candidates in the competition. Autism Diagnosed with autism, wow. she works hard to help empower those people with special needs. She may be born in the Netherlands, but she's one of the most stunning and deserving Miss Curaçao ever. At number 5, South Africa, Natasha Uber. It's the first time in the history of South Africa that a second runner-up was appointed as Miss Universe. Nothing but authenticity from her. When it comes to the tone of her voice, uh, she has improved her, her speaking skills and relatability. She, she has be grown this so much as a universe. candidate and as a woman. She is exactly what the pandemic needs. Someone who's <laughs> humble, who embraces her imperfections, right. and celebrates diversity and authenticity. She will inspire many with her effortless beauty and intelligence. For uh, me, a potential back-to-back. -back. Correct. Me too. Because she, she was like appointed. And then. At number four. Might Peru, be the, this will be her Janique last. Janique Maceta. Another stunning candidate from Peru with hazel brown eyes. She will and be my one number one. Most beautiful face edition. In order Peru to win is the my crown, number one. Second Philippines. isn't enough. You also need to want the crown and want it with all your heart. This passarella queen wants yeah. it badly and she's in it. To, to win, win it. it. Passarella Queen. She was the number one Topping on uh, America, Crown Sisters at previous three, video. Bolivia, Lenka Nemer, a polyglot, but I'd rather call her Bubbly Bolivia. She has the most amazing personality. Utterly engaging, 
and takes immense pride in her culture. I smile Bravo. when I see this girl. I just love everything about her. That's cool and nice. This is so interesting. I enjoy this. I enjoy this so much. Ooh, wow. I love the smile. Like the eyes also. Like At smiling. number two, oh, the please. Philippines, Rabia Mateo. She may get criticism. But she turns negative into positive. She loves the pressure, a typical Ooh. Filipino fighter. Her fearless personality comes from her humble beginnings. For many people, she may sound like a lecturer when she speaks. She but all I hear is a passion for education. Philippines is a role model, a powerful spokesperson who always speaks the truth uncompromisingly. She is like a diamond. The more you cut her, the more brilliant she becomes. If right. she wins this year, she would be the third Miss Universe from her country in the last five, five years. This great list fan named Cambodia. Oh my goodness, my number Topping one. Topping our leaderboard. At number one, Cambodia. Sarita Ret. Every year, Cambodia is going from strength to strength and despite being only the fourth candidate to represent her country, her popularity in her social media presence grew overnight without getting involved in any drama. <laughs> I'm not totally surprised as this multi-talented girl checks all the boxes. The Gloria Diaz of Southeast Asia caught my eye early on as she is unexpectedly good. She's one of those who are not afraid to be daring. On and off stage, she has a commanding air about her, even when she's smiling. Right. She may look like a delicate oriental flower, but she could be the Miss Universe silent assassin. If she wins, not only will she be the first Cambodian winner, but she will also be the first to place in any international pageant. Wow, correct. That beauty alone. She is incredibly amazing and beautiful. Another extra These fan. ladies may not be chart leaders right now, but that could all change USA. in the coming weeks. Any one of these it's candidates awesome. could win the it's crown. Awesome Their best weapon in the competition, there's no pressure for them to win. If they are able to keep a calm demeanor throughout the competition, right. Maybe they could they will snatch get victory from Columbia. any of the hot favorites and win it for their wow, country. Singapore. Spain, oh my god. Spain should be there, Costa Rica. Bahamas. Who oh, amongst these girls Romania. is your favorite to win the Miss Universe crown? Let us know what you think in the Panama. comments below. If you made it this far, thank you for watching. Leos. And always remember, Never be ashamed of who you are. Right. But please, keep your mask on. Those women are so astonishing and so astounding with the way how Crown Sister chooses with their top 21. It's so incredibly amazing and I like those top 21 also and it's on my list and guys I hope that this some of this lady will give surprises in the in this uh, final performance of this year's Miss Universe because I know that uh, all of them are deserved to get that crown because it, uh, they represent their country and give hard work also to represent their country and this young lady advocates with their uh, like the process that they are representing and I know it's very difficult because they are the voice of their process that they are representing. And I hope this lady, I will say good luck to you and happy Mother's Day to all the mothers around the world. And thank you so much, guys. If you want to see the full video, it's on the description box below. If you like this video, guys, same as I did, just give a massive thumbs up. Like and share, subscribe also with my channel. And this is Junris Reacting. Stay humble, stay positive, guys. Thank you so much to all the pageant enthusiasts and to all the pageant like uh, supporters. Thank you so much for this amazing video of support with Crown Sister because she's making a very nice compilation of these young ladies. Thank you so much, Crown Sisters. And this is Junior's reaction. Stay humble, stay positive, guys.
Bye, and see you in my next video reaction. If you have some comments, suggestions related to this video, guys, or any pageantry, drop it on the comment section. I'd love to read and respond to you all and make your video reactions. Have a good day, everyone. Bye-bye, guys.